I've been waiting for this special moment all my life. All I had was a baby picture. In the back of the baby picture was my birth mother's name. And I was trying to search based on that name, and I had no luck. I've been in a search to find my birth family. The only way I thought I could was taking a DNA test, which I chose my heritage. At the age of 21, my sister gave birth to her daughter, and my sister was incapable of taking care of her. But I wanted to do a DNA test. And my son, being that it was close to Christmas, said, Dad, I'll, I'll get it for you for Christmas. We had a DNA match with Linda which happened to be my niece. So I told him my birth name, I told him my birth mother's name, and he said, oh my gosh, I am your uncle. Linda's mother, uh, she died in her sleep. And so when, obviously when I told my mom, my mom was over the moon. They wanted to see me right away. They was like, can you get on the first flight? <laughs> and to see my uncle. And he looks just like me. Her adopted parents. Um, I thank them so much. Thank you. Thank you thank so much. You. That's my girl. I know. What are you talk about? Thank you. Because she took the responsibility that my sister wasn't able. But we always had her best interest. And her best interest was to let her go. My grandmother looks just like me. We both have the same nose. <laughs> She's the closest thing I have since I can't meet, meet my birth mother. I think my heritage DNA for um, this opportunity that they have given the world. Using my heritage, using the DNA for them to link to me and my uncle. Her grandmother is just gorgeous and her uncle, the sisters, like my sisters. I'm happy 